five days later and five doors down. It's just crazy that it was right here. This is the spot where the search for five year old Lizzie Shelley ended. And we just honestly like couldn't believe it. Like we just couldn't wrap our heads around it that they had actually found her. Kylie Black lives here. She tells me she broke down in tears when she heard the news that Lizzie's body was found here. And we were just like shaken. Like all, I, we were both just like kind of shaking. The site is less than a block from the home where Lizzie disappeared. And it's not like this area hadn't been searched. The property owner tells me there were teams here on Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. They even dug up some compost in this yard looking for any sign of Lizzie. Investigators likely knew Alex Whipple had come through here because this is the same property where they found the discarded beer can. I'm from the corner it comes down here and then the ditch comes down this way. Clyde Baugh lives along the canal that leads to the grove. I think he came right down here. It's frustrating for everyone that it took five days to find Lizzie so close. And then she was just, you know, she was just back there for way too long.